All right, fuckers, so we're back for more Shining Force Gaiden Final Conflict, and we're done in this bitch-ass camp of Ribble. So let's head on to the next battle. Oh, yeah, here's my music again. Da -na 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 -na. This usually means shit is about to go down in Shining Force 2, and I think we can quickly assume that it's going to be the same way in this game as well. All right, so we're still going over to Ruberan's hideout. Now, most of the battlefields we've been on thus far... Well, actually, every battlefield we've been on thus far is a location from Shining Force 2. This is not, like, really a location that we ever see in Shining Force 2, but we're just on some random bridge somewhere. All right, the bridge is starting to shake. Oh, shizzle. <gasps> Mazaka! It couldn't be! The Kraken? Say what? Battle 4? The Kraken? What is this? What is life right now? That is the legendary Kraken. Are you fuck- Are you telling me Michela unleashed the Kraken on us? What the- Yeah, Adam's just like, Oh, yeah, looks like we're gonna have a little difficulty here. Yeah, no shit, Adam. Thank you. Yeah, defeat us so you can get across. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, so... This is a little bit of a- of a trick here. Now, even though, you know, we do have to actually fight, you know, the Kraken arms and the Kraken legs, this isn't actually, like, a boss. We don't actually fight the Kraken here. I guess the assumption is that, you know, we're going to, like, scare the Kraken away, and then, you know, Bowie and Peter and the normal gang in Shining Force 2, later on, they finish it off. We just kind of, you know, scare it away. So I guess I could see what they're going for. But I think it would have been a little cooler if we actually got to fight the big bastard himself. Although that uh, bubble attack of his would have had to been nerfed quite a bit this early in the game. Uh, okay, so we have Cynthia now, a healer. Uh, looks like she's got heal 1 and heal 2. Now see, isn't this some shit right here? Alright, so Cynthia's level 4, right? That doesn't seem too crazy. You're like, oh, okay, level 4. Let's assume that each level up her MP goes up 1. So that means this bitch was level 1 with 3 MP? Are you fucking kidding me, Cynthia? Enough for one heal? God damn you. Uh, the rest of this- I don't think this fight is going to be very tough. Uh, I do want to probably protect Cynthia, though. You know, I don't want to get too, too, too nuts here. Uh, but we are very strong. Uh, we do have some new weapons, so we are definitely going to be able to really put up a good fight against this bastard. This definitely is, like, an interesting, neat idea for a fight here, where we get to fight the Kraken. Well, ki we kind of get to fight the Kraken here. I always do enjoy, like, Shining Force... Oh, that could go on the bridge? That was weird. Uh, but I do enjoy these Shining Force battles where we're, like, able to, you know, traverse, like, this, you know, bridge that's breaking. This is pretty cool. Okay, cool. So, I put Ian along the side there to lure that tentacle in. Looks like it worked. Okay, listen. Sonnet. Cynthia. Stay away from the edges, okay? We've seen enough hentai to know where this is going. These tentacles are staying far, far away from my girls. No. No. Ian is like, no, I'm a hero for a reason, bitch. Leader of the Shining Force. You're not getting my chicas. It's only seven experience, huh? Uh, Howl. I mean, fuck it. Sure, take his bitch ass down. Okay, so this Kraken, like, that, uh, that was not very tough. Goodbye! <laughs> Later, Kraken Leg! Ooh, nice. Level 8, okay. So, 2 MP, nice. Defense, okay. Good, solid level up. Ooh, Blaze 2! Hey! Blaze 2, I like that howl. Uh, Mead. Let me put Mead right here. I do want to draw that tentacle arm in. Let me be careful with Cynthia. Uh, let me make sure... Because the tentacle arm, it's just like in Shining Force 2. It can attack from two panels away. So, let me not bait that tentacle arm into attacking Cynthia. Because every other character will be fine taking uh, shots from these guys. But Cynthia I, I, does make me a little nervous here. Uh, and of course, like I explained, um, any grinding sessions I do in this game are mainly going to be to catch up new characters. Uh, Cynthia included. Uh, w the next time we get a new character... Uh, I will probably, you know, take a break and we'll uh, catch Cynthia and the next new character up to the rest of the force here. Uh, okay, so I think 
if if I start moving really far for oh okay here we go yeah but it, that's the reason that that tentacle arm was able to go across that area is because that bridge later on was gonna break oh I could see the seams in the game oh this early game gear game oh no okay oh the Kraken is no longer our concern get across quickly even though he says that you know it's not about to be like oh shit you know we have to get off the bridge quick or we're dead it's just I don't know, I guess that line of dialogue is supposed to confirm, like, yeah, you're not actually going to be fighting the Kraken today. Uh, okay, so Cynthia... Yeah, I don't really want to move her forward. You know what, Cynthia's not really going to be doing a whole hell of a lot. Let me go ahead and just toss out some random heals while I can. Uh, let's get her a little bit of experience here. Looks like she's got an Ankh equipped. Uh, how do you say that properly? A-N-K-H? That's actually a weapon type in Shining Force 3. And it looks exactly like that. Okay, cool. Here you come. Going for Sonnet. Or Sonnet. Probably one? Oh, two. Oh, 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 shit. He got a crit. Two damage. Oh, no. Anything but two damage. And Mead also takes two. Okay. Uh, hmm. I'm trying to think. Eventually, this Kraken arm is going to become active. And he's going to start moving in. So... I'm going to leave Cynthia at the back there. Maybe Cynthia, Howell, and maybe I'll leave Paige. Hold on, let me put... Huh, I'm trying to think. You know what? Paige is slow enough anyway. So I'm going to leave Paige, Howell, and Cynthia back there. They'll fight uh, that arm when it becomes active. We'll have Mead and the rest move forward and take these uh, other legs down. Okay, it takes about half. Yeah, oh, whoa, shit. That shows just how strong Ian is. Hold on, hold on. Alright, so Ian's attack is 26. Meads is 21 with the Bronze Lance. Damn! And then Knuckles is at 24. And you're at 21, okay. Uh, Paige, can you kill this? Nice, 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 okay. Yeah, this is not... This battle does not really do justice to, like, uh, the difficulty of some of the Kraken fights in other Shining Force games. How many other Shining Force games have Kraken fights, actually? Well, there is one in Shining Force 3 that is incredibly fun. Okay, so I still want to be really careful of Cynthia here. I don't want to move Cynthia from this spot, because where she currently is, that Kraken arm can't reach her. So she's just chilling there. Uh, yeah, we'll have Sonic go right here and take you down. Well, at least make it so that probably Knuckles will be able to take you down. Um, because that mod of Shining Force 2 I played, Shining Force 2 Battle Royale. Oh, fuck you. And that will do... Ooh, six! Damn! Damn, damn, damn. That is a big shot. Uh, so I guess I probably could let Howl take him down. But why don't we show off Knuckles' new and improved strength? Yeah, look at that. Here I am trying to keep Cynthia back there, and she still got exposed to danger. Look at this shit right here. Mm-mm-mm. Okay, anyway, yeah. So, Shining Force 2 Battle Royale, that mod I played, I, that did not have a Kraken battle. Shining Force 3 does. That fight is fucking awesome. I love that fight. So, that's going to be really fun when we uh, get to that. Let's see, Shining Force 1 does not have a Kraken fight. Did Shining Force CD? Holy fuck, how do I not remember this? Shining Force... No, I don't think there was a Kraken fight in Shining Force CD. Oh, okay, so the Kraken mainly is just like a Shining Force 2 enemy then, it seems. Alright, let me go ahead and uh, heal Cynthia again. Damn, girl, be careful, fuck. Taking shots from these tentacles here, man. Uh, Paige. Well, Knuckles is all the way back there anyway, so we'll just have Paige move forward. Uh, at this point, I'm not really super, super nervous about... Oh, hello. Uh, I'm not super nervous about the rest of the force being up here without healers. Uh, they are more than capable. Okay, so Knuckles is gonna stay put. So is Howl. Alright. Actually, I feel like... Bringing Mead over here, that tentacle leg might be drawn over to him. Really, the the arm is still not active. Okay, that, hey man, I, you know what? 
Who, who is it for me to say tentacle arm, you know, actually do fucking something? These, this Kraken is very lazy. He's just like, whatever, I'm just gonna let these legs just chill. Okay, going for Mead, whatever. I don't care. Yeah, that's right. Mead says, fuck you, you're not touching me. Going for Paige, that's okay. Paige, yes, finally off screen when I was leveling Paige up. Paige finally got some fucking HP. Knuckles, just stay put. We're waiting for that arm. Uh, Ian. Yeah, we'll just put Ian, like, over here. Howl, you're fine. Just, just wait there. Okay. Uh, let's see. So we've got Paige is going to attack this one over here. Actually, I'm gonna have Mead come attack this Kraken leg. And then Paige, oh, it dodged. Oh, damn you, damn you. Uh-oh, uh-oh, here we go. How much is this gonna do to me? Three, oh shit. Three, damn, that hurts. Ah, anything but three damage, my only weakness. I know I do wanna be careful of these giant bats that are just chilling up there also, by the way, because they are going to, oh, only three, okay. Because they are, they're going to, what was I going to say? Ah, whatever, fuck. These tentacles are not that strong. Oh yeah, the giant bats, they can put me to sleep. So I would preferably like to control all these tentacles before giant bats start coming down here. Oh, nice, level up. Oh, two health, good, Paige, good. Okay, oh, he is starting to move in. Going for Ian. Okay, that's all right. So a little bit of a slower battle here as I'm... The enemy is kind of controlling it because they're making me kind of like wait until they attack. Okay, Knuckles. Uh, well, there's not really much you could do. Maybe I could try and put Knuckles like right... Fuck, I guess we're just going to have Knuckles heal Howl. And then I guess Howl will just pepper it with Blaze 2. Two Blaze 2s probably will be sufficient to kill it, actually. Oh, another leg. Okay. Alright, I want this leg taken down ASAP, though. Really, as long as I'm just a uh, little careful with the Kraken arms, the legs pose literally no threat whatsoever. Uh, yeah, two Blaze 2s should be good enough. Okay, cool. Yeah, this isn't fucking normal Shining Force 2 where these fucking Kraken legs are very, very resistant to Blaze. Uh, yeah. Because if I do this, that Kraken arm's probably going to move in too, which I want. Ah, oh, damn it. I, I don't mind it attacking Ian. But I want it to come in so I, I can actually attack it with a character more than Sonnet. You damn arm! Pissing me off! Uh, Cynthia will remain put. Don't move, girl. Uh, let's see here. Okay, so we got a couple enemies there. I guess, let me just take this opportunity to begin attacking. Oh, wow, okay. I didn't think she was going to do that much. Alright, so you're going for Ian. That's not surprising. Oh, don't fall asleep, Ian. Okay, cool. Woo, 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 woo. Uh, looks like that giant bat's kind of starting to get into position here. Okay, Knuckles. I want Knuckles to begin heading up, although he probably won't be able to reach in time to do anything. Damn, I wish Ian had... Bolt or something. He's only got egress right now. <sighs> Hold on. If I go right here, uh, I bet that Kraken arm will follow. They're all gonna follow. Yeah, I'm gonna put Ian right there. That's fine. And you're done. Cool. So now Cynthia is very, very safe, which is Pretty much the number one most important thing here. Okay, Mead. Yeah, we'll have Mead. Uh, I'm going to put Mead right here, and I'm going to use a spear against the giant bat. 
Now, I don't think these giant bats are dodging machines quite like they are in, you know, Shining Force 1, for example. But I think they are kind of pains in the asses, so... I don't want to underestimate them. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's gonna follow Ian, so let's take this bat out while we can. 15! Wow! Ooh, an antidote. Okay, that's cool. Uh, eventually there are gonna be enemies that poison us. I might actually just sell that antidote, though. Yes, my plan worked to perfection. The Kraken arm is against this bridge now, so I can actually just straight up attack it. Although, San... Sonnet might be able to kill it, actually. No, okay. It was just because she got a crit last time. That's fine. Alright, so we got this bat and then another Kraken leg over there. Okay, cool. No one's asleep. I'm, I'm liking this. We're, this is good. This is good. Knuckles. Let's just have Knuckles go ahead and drop a heal here. Um, you know, he's got this MP. I might as well use it and gain some quick, easy experience while I can. Okay, Ian can uh, lure this other tentacle over. Go ahead and start moving Howl this way. Okay, Mead. Uh, let's go ahead and drop this fucker. Wait, 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 wait. And now I'll let Pit. Well, no, no, no. Let me, let me get rid of this thing before it moves away and it's difficult to kill. All right, cool. A hundred gold. I like that. All right, we'll have Sana attack the bats. Damn, 12. Impressive, girl. Oh, wow. Now Paige is going to be able to drop him. Cool. Bitch, sit down. We don't... We're not scared of fucking bats, okay? We're just not. The Shining Force is not scared of one little bat bitch. All right, so here's the final enemy. A shot from Ian and a shot from Mead, and it'll be done. And we're done with this battle. Nice. Yeah, now you guys can see exactly what I was talking about, where I say... This is not exactly the Shining Force 2 Kraken fight. Uh, pretty much the... Oh, what is this? Out of nowhere, another fucking Kraken leg shows up to piss me off. I wonder if there's some sort of time limit. Huh. Whatever. Alright, well, we're not... Oh, god damn it. Oh, look at me. Okay, Cynthia, yeah, you're not going anywhere, girl. Oh, son of a fucking bitch. Paige, just go right there. And we'll wait for this uh, leg to come in. So, yeah, you're just going to attack Ian and do one. We don't care. Bop. All right, hopefully no other fucking Kraken legs show up while we're just getting rid of these two right here. Although, Knuckles is going to put some work in, boy. Show off that second highest attack on the force, Knuckles. Yeah. Yeah. Knuckles the Echidna. Ooh, three health. Oh, don't mind if I do. Not three attack that time, but still a lot of good other stat gains there. Alright, Howl. Not quite in range, so it looks like... Mead will actually be able to finish this battle off. Nice. Goodbye, Mr. Leg. Fuck yourself. Alright, yep. So we're alive! No one is dead! Adam, we did it! Wow, the Kraken is not attack- uh, Why is the Kraken not attacking now? Whatever. Okay, so yeah, like right here, it's like, oh shit. You know, the Kraken is just about to attack. Uh-oh. Like, this is actually really weird. There's currently- no enemies on the battlefield right now. There's nothing. It's literally just us. Alright, this is probably going to be sufficient. They want you to get far enough and then... Oh, no, I guess not. Okay. And then I believe a cutscene should be starting soon here. Sonnet will just go right there. Yeah, look, everyone has a little bit of damage, but we are A-OK. -okay. Uh, our defensive stats are all high enough, and there's no 
enemies that are using magic quite yet to where this could be uh, scary at all. Okay, here we go. Okay, this looks like that looks like yogurt right there. It sure is yogurt, yogurt, whatever. And all right, what? <laughs> what? Why is yogurt getting screen time? Okay, bye, yogurt. And here we have just another random thief. That is the fucking weirdest shit. Just for no reason. Here's Jogurt. Alright, so it looks like uh, Ruberin's subordinate's gonna help us here. He's gonna get the Kraken off our back. Okay. Alright, well, the Kraken's just fucking off later then. Nasu. Okay. The Kraken can't stand the smell of it in biz ounces. Okay, so I guess... What? <laughs> the Kraken... So the dude, he just farted and the Kraken was like, Oh, fuck this. Fuck this. I'm just gonna wait for Bowie to show up. The bridge is falling away? Oh, no. So that means we can't return the way we came. It doesn't matter because we have to go find Max anyway. Okay, so yeah, what's going on? So is Michelle fucking these dudes, raping them or something? Like, what's what's going on? What's good? Okay, so Nasu escaped. That woman. Gotta be Michelle. Alright, we're gonna go to a secret base now. Sure, let's do it. To, to Ruberin's secret base. Are we prepared to depart for battle? Yes, I am. But that will do it for today. Goodbye, friends.